So if you're admin noted user, the new update is here for you based on MIUI 12.0.3.0 stable version based on Android version 11. It's a China stable update. It is not released globally. It is not released in India. It's just released in China. We don't know just approximately five to six months ago MIUI 12.0.1.0 stable version was released in me in China China region and now we have another update for you it's been approximately more than five months so it's been a long time but now they just give a new update for you the thing is in this new update you don't get anything much new here almost same kind of features are present for you we're talking about the MIUI 12.0.3 stable version is here and you can also apply it via OTA if you are using a China region variant on your device but if you are using India variant of course you need to have unlocked bootloader and custom recovery installed it's based on Android version 11 as you can see if it is based on Android version 11 so yes all the Android 11 features are present for you as you can see we have the navigation bar pill present which is not available in Android version 10 MIUI 12 update it also has the April security patch it doesn't have the May security patch June is of course not there so a little bit different here moving on to the control center first of all and as you can see the control center still have this gray shade available for you redmi noted users unfortunately bad luck for you but yes there is no blur in the control center yet but maybe in miui 12.5 android 11 you might see this blur but unfortunately in miui 12 android 11 update unfortunately there is still no blur available for you also it is actually china stable so maybe a proprietary update maybe we will get miui 12.5 stable version very soon not sure but maybe but the thing is moving on to some other things the default thing default launcher as expected it's a china stable so is all the chinese apps are present for you and you might not get the google play store pre-installed if you are looking to install this update on your device make sure to keep this thing in mind that google play store is not pre-installed and how to install the google play store i made a dedicated video on that one too that how you can install google play store in china rooms so make sure to watch out that i will try to pin that in the comment section moving on to some other things as you can see the stability and smoothness might be the same like the previous one so there might be no issues there might be no differences here and this navigation bar pill as i previously mentioned you navigation bar pill is added here it was added in the MIUI 12.0.1.2 stable version also it's the same in this one too we can also hide the full screen indi indicator we have the buttons options almost same thing and buttons are from china so yes these are not global buttons as you can see we have the full screen indicator option available for you they added this navigation bar pill as you can see but the control center still has the gray options which is something weird but yes it is what it is we have this kind of gray option available which honestly doesn't seem to be very good we have the full screen indicator for you but unfortunately the control center blur option is not there so yes these are some major changes here in the system navigation you just saw all these things which you can see on the on my device and it's almost same in your device also so there might be no changes here the fonts are also from the china region as you can see it's just up to you if you also want to hide the full screen indicator you can hide that if you don't want that pill on your device but yes it's present for you in the default launcher yes we have all these settings for example the arrange items in recents the new arrange items in recents horizontally or uh, horizontally and vertically both of the options are present for you and the default launcher has this option so don't worry about that floating windows present for you the availability of ram free ram is also option is present here for you almost everything seems to be same icon size customization so no extra customizations of course it's china reason stable version it's not a modded rom it's an official stable update so yes all the features which you were looking for are present here just just simply forget about the control center blur everything else is just same now moving on to the battery section yes i didn't test the battery backup but let me show you the stats as you can see the battery stats are changed now it's something new ui it was not available in other rooms especially new ui 12 update but we have this battery saver as you can see this is the new ui which you get here privacy protection is actually same but the battery saver 
option or you can see battery cell menu is changed in the theme store yes it has a chinese theme store of course china rooms allows you to import the third party themes so you can import the third party themes if you want to but everything else is just kind of same some little changes which you just saw and everything else is same with the april security patch android 11 mui 12.0.3 stable version link for this update is in the des description if you're using china stable you can update it via ota or you need a custom recovery for this this was all thanks for watching goodbye have a nice day Like I'm floating through the air